AI avatars and deepfakes are getting insanely realistic. You can clone your own voice and likeness, swap faces, and even change up the emotion and the clothing of your avatar. AI generated avatars and text to speech can save us tons of time when it comes to creating content. But the problem is, there are loads of AI avatar tools out there, and it can be really difficult knowing where to start and which ones offer the best text to speech features and which have the most realistic avatars. Luckily, I've tried out all almost every AI avatar tool available over the last three years when creating virtual humans that power my company's soft skills training scenarios that are used by some big customers like Amazon. So in today's video, we're going to explore the 10 best AI avatar tools available today, analyzing their features, benefits, and drawbacks to help you find the best one for you. I've added links in the description down below to all of the tools so you can try them out for yourself. And I've included two bonus tools at the end of today's video. And I'll also reveal what I think is the best AI avatar platform out there. So be sure to stick around. With that being said, hit that subscribe button and let's get right into it with the first AI avatar our tool on the list. First on the list, we've got Veed, who are kindly sponsoring today's video, and they've integrated text-to-speech, voice cloning, and AI avatars into their cloud-based video production suite. You can choose from over 50 AI avatars of various genders, attires, personalities, and voices. Veed also allows you to manage and upload your own image and turn it into a personalized avatar, but this feature is at an additional cost. To use AI avatars in Veed, you need to be on a business plan and then you can head over to the media section, select your avatar, enter your text, and then select your voice or use Veed's voice cloning feature to clone your own voice if you want. This then adds your avatar with your voice to your video and allows you to then use Veed's full suite of video editing tools to update the background and every other aspect of the video. Unlike many of the other text-to-speech AI avatar tools on this list, Veed is primarily a video editing platform and so you've got access to a much wider choice of video editing tools like captions, animations, and more powerful editing tools like resizing for socials and exporting in a much wider range of formats and resolutions. Veed's AI avatars are available on their business plan, which is £49 per user per month or £588 annually. If you're looking for the most flexible AI avatar generator out there, look no further than DID. DID comes with their Creative Reality Studio that allows you to create a realistic AI avatar in just a few minutes. But the real power comes from DID's API interface that allows developers to more deeply integrate AI avatar creation into their own apps. Now in the Reality Studio, you can choose from an existing selection of photorealistic or illustrated faces, or you can upload an image of your own. You can also use their text to image AI to generate any face that you can imagine. You can then add text to speech and export your work. Now I really like DID as it goes way beyond many of the other tools on this list that simply provide short video clips of your avatar. For example, DID also offers a chat system that streams your avatar in real time, a little bit like conversing with a real human, which is great if you want to create an agent or chatbot. And it also offers some really helpful integrations with tools like Canva and even Power point. The cost of DID is one of its potential drawbacks, however, as while the features and realism are high quality, pricing can scale up pretty quickly. That being said, a free plan comes with five minutes of video to try out, and then paid plans scale up based on usage. Now next up, Microsoft have quietly released a preview version of Azure AI Speech's text-to-speech avatar tool, which is a new feature available on Microsoft Azure services that enables users to create talking avatar videos via text input and to build real-time interactive bots trained using human images. Now to access this, it's via Azure's AI Speech Studio, which is available to Microsoft Azure users. Like other tools, you can select your avatar, but unlike many others, Azure allows you to add things like gestures and even whether the avatar is seated or standing, giving you quite a bit more control than the standard close-up of a head and shoulders. As your text-to-speech avatar is currently in preview and pricing is based on usage through Microsoft Azure. The good news here is that Azure has lots of free credit packages available for first-time users and also for business users. Next up, we've got Coliseum, which has a nice library of realistic looking avatars and a clean minimalist editor interface. 
they've focused on the learning niche. And while I don't really agree that watching an AI avatar is going to massively boost learning engagement or outcomes, Colossian have rolled out the ability to add two avatars to a scene to simulate watching a conversation. The creation system works a little bit like a slide deck. You add an avatar to a single scene and then one to the next one before finally exporting your collection altogether. The focus here is less about the learners and more about saving time and effort for the people creating the learning materials. And to that end, they have a huge library of templates to help you to get started. Pricing starts at $28 per month based on 10 minutes of video per month and then plans scale up with usage and features with more expensive plans offering more minutes, avatars and editor seats. HeyGen is probably the most comprehensive AI avatar platform on this list, and it also comes with a very generous free tier, so it's a great place to start experimenting. HeyGen allows you to choose from an instant avatar, an off-the-shelf avatar, which you can then edit, or a 2D talking photo from an image. They also have a real-time avatar, which you can chat with in real time using ChatGPT in the pipeline too. Now to get started with HeyGen, you can choose from some of the existing instant avatar templates, which have been fine-tuned to sit at desks and in realistic environments, giving a nice alternative to the standard head and shoulders seen in other avatar tools. You can then customize the avatar with some pretty nice features, including a face swapping tool and an AI outfit tool that allows you to change the color of an avatar's clothes, which is really cool. Not only are these cool, they also add more control and variation to your avatar, making them stand out when they're used online. In addition to the pre-made options, you can also upload a video and create your very own instant avatar. Doing so requires at least two minutes of footage shot using a high resolution camera. And it's nice that you can do this without needing to upgrade or speak to a sales team outside of the platform. HeyGen's biggest selling point is that its free forever plan comes with one instant avatar and access to over 120 public avatars and voices, face swap, AI outfit change, and talking photo. Then prices start at £24 per month for the creator plan, which offers additional features and creation credits. Now next up, Synthesia was one of the first movers in the AI avatar space, and they have some really realistic looking avatars, which allow you to add micro gestures, such as facial expressions, meaning that you can make them nod, smirk, smile, and more to boost realism. Synthesia does have an API for developers, but it's still in beta. And that being said, they've probably fallen behind a little bit compared to other platforms when it comes to features. Synthesia has a similar number of stock avatars and languages as to others, and uses a slide-based creation system to add avatars to scenes of your video before exporting. The interface is clean and Synthesia really wins if you're looking for the most realistic looking avatars out there and you don't need expanded features seen in other tools like HeyGen or DID. Synthesia offers a free trial plan and then pricing starts at $20 per month for 10 minutes of video per month, with more expensive plans offering more avatars and video minutes. Now next, Ally.io is a convincing authentic avatar creator that enables users to create engaging content using virtual characters. Ally's avatars aren't as realistic as some others seen on this list with some noticeable lip syncing issues, but they do have an API allowing you to use their avatar creation tools outside of their platform. Ally works by using templates and selection from one of 80 available avatars. In addition, you can also upload an existing PowerPoint document to Ally and then make it more engaging with an avatar. They offer a free trial alongside three paid plans starting at $23 per month for 15 minutes of AI avatar video. Now, Vidnos offers over 300 AI avatars to choose from and have a very accessible voice cloning tool that you can access straight away on their free forever plan that offers three minutes of video per month. Interestingly, Vidnos also offers a video editing only pricing plan and a face swapping only pricing plan. So if you only need a specific part of their platform, you have a choice from the point of sign up. Vidnos uses templates and avatar selection within a slide based editor similar to Synthesia and the avatar realism is okay, but there are definitely more realistic options on this list. That being said, with the free tier and pricing starting at $15 per month for 10 minutes of video per month, Vidnos is a great accessible place to start if you're looking for something more affordable. 
Okay, DeepBrain has become a popular choice for users after they teamed up with celebrities including Howie Mandel to show off their personalized AR avatar creation. As well as all the AR avatar features you might expect, DeepBrain also has an effortless and reliable face swapping ability. I found that DeepBrain's templates were a little bit messy compared to some of the more minimalist backgrounds and slide layouts of tools on this list, but that's just my personal preference. That being said, the avatars themselves are actually way better than the editor and template design and they demonstrate a really strong amount of realism. One big plus for many people with DeepBrain is that you can jump in right now without even having to sign up and try it out. DeepBrain starts at $24 per month and then prices scale up after. And last on our list, Synthesis nicely spits up its creation features into AI humans, AI voices, and AI images. Its biggest win, however, comes from its free tier and then non-usage-based pricing plans. While having many of the features of other platforms on this list, like avatar and slide selection and templates, Synthesis's editor is a little more unique, which may or may not be to your liking. The free plan offers two minutes of AI video avatars and two minutes of voice per month, and paid plans then start at $49 per month for unlimited usage and five AI voice clones, which is very generous and a lot less complicated than usage-based pricing. Okay, now before I wrap up and talk about which tools I think are the best on this list, I wanted to add in two extra bonus tools. First up, we have Speechify, who've added AI avatars to their suite of AI audio tools. Avatars are housed in Speechify's studio, and as you'd expect from a recent new feature launch, there aren't quite as many avatars to choose from as more established tools on this list. That being said, the voice options are excellent, and the interface allows you to swap between a slide view and a speech view to quickly edit your text. You can try out the editor for free, and then Speechify Studio starts at $24 per month. Now the second bonus AI avatar tool on the list is actually from one of my companies, Verti. Verti is an enterprise tool selling to businesses and it uses both AI video as well as computer generated avatars. Verti's virtual human creator allows lots of customization and interaction with computer generated avatars. And as Verti is focused on scenario based learning and soft skills training like sales negotiation, each of the interactive scenarios is mapped to a learning objective or learning outcome that needs to be achieved. Verti works on desktop and mobile as well well as in spatial computing headsets like the new Apple Vision Pro, where you can actually move around and interact with your AI avatar. The bad news here is that Verti is only B2B SaaS, although you can play with some of the web-based scenarios by heading over to try.verti.com now. Okay, so in terms of all of the tools on today's list, what's my overall opinion? Well, we're seeing more and more AI avatar and video tools popping up as most use the same underlying system. They train an AI model using 3D captured video of some actors who've given their permission and their likeness to be used, and then they use AI lip syncing tools to map the text input to the avatar you see on screen. If you're interested, many of these platforms use variants of open source libraries like Deepface Lab and wav to lip both of which can be explored and installed through Google Collab Notebook. For me, Veed, DID and HeyGen are the standouts from all the tools that I've tried on this list and beyond. As Veed is primarily a video player, it offers more flexibility and video export options over the other tools who tend to use a slide-based system for editing, which I found quite limiting for the price you have to pay. DID wins for me on features and their developer API, and then HeyGen has a really nice free tier and features not seen in many other tools like being able to fine tune avatars and easily swap faces and clothes for added variation. Overall, I'd recommend thinking about how you're going to use these tools and their practical use before you dive in and pay any money. Now, I've got another great video covering AI tools that will absolutely blow your mind that I'll pop up over here that's well worth checking out. Thanks so much for watching today's video and for subscribing to the channel, and I'll catch you again in the next video.